going too fast really means that we are not taking enough time out of our day or putting aside enough hours to really do things apart from those things that have a primary work focus. I think our brains are so busy ticking. Uh, the availability of blackberries means that we're probably working way beyond nine to five. I know that I am and I think that people just need to seriously put aside time for their family, themselves, exercise and uh, not being interfered with by the outside world. We are now truly a city of substance. We are in the top 10 most livable cities in the world. And I think globally people are looking at Perth and realising that Perth's time has arrived. And obviously that dynamism that we're experiencing in our city comes at a cost. And that cost is the fact that people are working longer, uh, having to put in the hard yards. Um, you know, they're expected to be performing at a very high level and consistently over many weeks and months uh, so I think you know as much as it's bringing a lot of great things we need to just be very wary of not uh, you know foregoing a lot of the uh, niceties that Perth has also been highly regarded for. probably if I can pull back time for myself it is in the mornings so where my diary allows it or sometimes I factor it into my diary that I won't come into the office till 9 30 because I have this view that you can't give it at both ends of the day you know and I also have another phrase which I love to share and that is in my role because people don't want to see a grumpy person they're wanting to see an upbeat happy accessible mayor who really is walking the talk I have a phrase sometimes I get a little bit peopled out and I just need to just pull back and have some me time because I'm only human and I just need to recharge my batteries occasionally too. You know, the fact that we're having this conversation right now is the most amazing thing because that is in itself a paradigm shift from where we were. From where we were, we were just going about our, our lives blindly and we weren't you know, consciously thinking of the fact that we need to slow down. So by just having this discussion, we're going to factor it in. Now, it might be hard to factor it in, you know, in the beginning, but if each and every day you claw back a few minutes, an hour tomorrow, two hours next week, hey, huge improvement. Slow down and enjoy the ride. <laughs>